I wish I knew. Welcome back to My Husband is My Best Friend. Peter Thomas on whether he would consider dating Cynthia Bailey again. Why? Why? Yo, let, let me let me tell you something about this Cynthia Bailey. First of all, she's going to be a guest on my podcast, and nobody has seen us on camera in probably around seven years. They haven't seen us on camera together in seven years, or seen us talking to each other in seven years. But I actually called Cynthia this weekend past and said, Cynthia, I just started my podcast, and I need you to be a guest. She said, oh, my God, Peter. (laughs) I'm so happy for you. You know, that's my uh, rendition of how Cynthia Bailey talked with a high voice, you know. Um, And she said, I would love to do it. And I said, why you didn't tell me you you signed him back on Housewife? She said, I'm uh, I just decided last night that I was going to do it. I mean, that's how she is. It's last minute shit. She probably like, you know, I can use the money because Cynthia don't like to leave nothing on the table. She want all the bread. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> all the bread. But, you know, I'm glad she's doing it because she's an incredible personality. She's a beautiful soul. And, you know what I'm saying? And, and uh, can you need a friend? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Kenya you need your friend. Ain't nobody gonna tolerate Kenya but Cynthia. If y'all didn't know that. Okay? You know. I always thought you need good and evil. Good and evil is a good balance. That's why we got God and we got Satan, right? But Satan ain't shit. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna roll with God every time. Feel me? Alright, so with that said, can you need your friend? <laughs> I'm not calling Kenya no name. I actually like Kenya. She's smart as <laughs> You know what I'm saying? But she played villain very well. And she can't help it. She's just like a mischievous little fucking gnat that will never go away. She ain't gonna keep on coming at you, coming at you. Because she's mad smart and she know how to get the paper. Okay? That's what I think. Mm-hmm. All right. Hey, but y'all got to stop asking me about me and Cynthia because we're friends. You know, like how Leon... Is our baby daddy and their friends like this? Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Well, me and Cynthia ain't like this, but we like, we like this. (laughs) You know what I'm saying? She's my people. She cool as With that said, but we ain't never, ever going to get back together because neither one of us entertain what's in the rearview mirror and our relationship is in the rearview mirror you know it's not in that big ass mirror in front of us that we gotta look where we're going every now and then we glimpse in the rearview mirror glimpse Ross Club that they're behind me <laughs> that they're behind me that's about it all right and we keep it moving okay all right. And sometimes what's behind us, you just let it come and catch up with you every now and then, entertain it, and then take off again. Cha, Megan. Like that. You know what I mean? Okay. All right. That's being sent to. We have love for each other, but we're not in love with each other. Big difference. Okay. You know, maybe when I'm 75 and, you know, like, uh, when I'm 75 and she's like, uh, where is she now? 58? You know, older than I'm five years old. Yeah, and she's 70. If she don't have a boyfriend, I think I'm going to ask her out. Because <laughs> she's good people. We like the same type of things, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and we're like, we, we, we have similar tastes. My taste is actually better than hers, but we have similar tastes. You know what I'm saying? Maybe if I'm 70 and I don't have I don't have a girlfriend and she's no 75 I don't have a girlfriend and she's 70 and she don't have a man. Yeah, I'll take her out on dates. We could talk a lot of shit and laugh. You know what I'm saying? I have fun. Mhm. That's about it. That's the closest it's going to get.
Oh, motherfuckers. I just want y'all to, to just give it another chance. Another chance. <laughs> Why is this so stupid? <laughs> we love you and Cynthia together. Just give it another chance. Not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> That's not gonna happen But I can't wait to do the podcast for her though, because We're gonna have some fun with it You know what I'm saying Like I said, Sentence is a beautiful soul You know We get along, we like each other Okay, we were friends before We were husband and wife And we we're friends again So let's just keep it in the friend zone You know what I mean Thanks for tuning in to My Husband is My Best Friend.